Okay, fine. In today's video, we will be discussing the concept of a representation of Turing machine. As we have already discussed regarding Turing machine, uh, the Turing machine is a model which can be represented in various ways. One of the representation is a transition diagram. And transition diagram was one of them. Uh, secondly, we have also discussed the representation of Turing machine using instantaneous uh, description. And the last, not the least, it is also represented by using transition table. Uh, but the constraint is that if you know transition diagram, how to draw a transition diagram, you can actually create instantaneous description. And same applies with if you know how to construct a transition diagram, you can easily construct the transition table. Transition uh, diagram is very, very important. I'm putting the link of a transition diagram question on the in the description box and same applies with the link of how to do instantaneous description in the description box so that is there in your description kindly see that i'm talking about a transition table but before that i'll create a, i'll take a particular example and i create a diagram of zero par n one par n and let's say greater than or equal to zero so uh, we created a Turing machine where 0 is converted to x and we are moving in right direction. We are having q1, we have 0, 0, r, uh, we have y, y, r. We have already done this. So the link is there in the des description box. 1, y, l, q2. Uh, we'll have all the y's and all the zeros before we encounter x. So this is also we have already created and y y r and q3 we have all the y's r and we are moving blank blank r q4 so i need to create a transition table of this the transition table of this can be constructed in this way if that uh, there are many things that you need to describe so one of them is uh, what is your present state uh, the state right uh, then you have to mention the transition so we are having the transitions with 0 then with 1 then with uh, y then with x then we have also a blank symbol where the transition is happening right so if i take the transition of q naught with a zero so zero is actually converted to x we are moving in a right direction and q naught changes to q1 so i'm writing x r q1 clear so that's how your q naught transition will uh, will will be done so this is this was q naught this is a present state and this is your q naught this is present state right then uh, q naught when one is given to it nothing happens uh, because there is nothing but q naught when one uh, y is given uh, it y changes to y uh, we are moving in right direction and q naught changes to q3 right so this is another thing we have uh, there is no transition with x so we are not writing that and q naught is not having a transition with blank either so i'm leaving it as such similarly uh, i'm taking with q1 q1 is having a transition with zero so zero changes to zero we are moving in the right direction and q1 does not change so it remains as such q1 when um, one is given so one changes to y we are moving in left direction and q1 changes to q2 so i'm writing like this right so q1 when y is given similarly y changes to y there is no change actually we have y then we are moving in right direction and we have got 
we have got q1 right so q1 when x is given so there is nothing given to it there is no blank frame symbol to it then we have got q2 q2 when y is given over here with zero uh, it is going to left direction so zero i'm writing zero l and what q2 q2 when one is given nothing uh, goes over here q2 when y is given so it is y l and q2 now q2 is given x so x is x q2 is 0 and we are moving in the right direction and q2 when b is given so there is nothing which is given over here similarly we got q3 so q3 when 0 is given nothing goes over here when 1 is given nothing when y is given y r and it goes to itself right so q3 when x is given nothing comes over here when blank is given we go to q4 so over here it will give me blank r and it will give me q4 so i am writing it like this p r and q4 fine and uh, q4 when blank is given nothing comes over here so this is how your entire process actually works out uh, so this is how this whole situation can work out accordingly so this is the scene for transition table it can be great and greater than equal to one it can work for this as well how problem is solved uh, if uh, n is greater than equal to zero we might have to write with blank also but we are not writing with blank so we are uh, taking it as n greater than equal to one and this uh, scenario works perfectly in all scenarios if there is any doubt kindly post the doubt in comment section and kindly like share and subscribe thank you very very much